Good morning, YouTube family. Welcome to my channel. Oh, I just got back in from walking little mama, Maddie Batty. Um, it's early in the morning. Oh, 8.35 is early for me. <laughs> um, I'm trying to decide, is it going to be coffee or tea this morning? Before I head out for my day. Um, I think I'm going to probably have some, um, tea. But anyways, welcome to my channel. Um, for those who are new here, welcome, welcome. Hope you'll stay a while. And for all of the folks that have already subscribed, you already know what it is. Thank you. Much appreciated. I think I'm probably going to do the lemongrass, ginger lemongrass tea this morning. I decided that since I ended up, um doing a braid out last night i was um i had just did the video on will smith slapping the hell out of um uh chris rock so i decided since i had ended up doing a braid out since i had ended up putting braids in that i might as well uh just come and do a quick video um taking the braids out so that we can see how the braid out came out I hope that um it worked out well it ain't got to be nothing real super fancy or anything I just as long as the braid out is um you know as long as the crinkles or whatever is in it then it should be fine let me see if I can set this phone up here somewhere where it does not fall down okay let's see See if I can get it here. Okay, yeah, that'll that'll have to do for now. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this braid out, out, and we'll see what it's looking like. I'm just gonna spray a little bit of my um botch and spray that I usually do, and then I'm gonna put just a tap of my rose hemp oil in my little sparse area here. And a little bit right now on the side. Just a little bit. And I'm going to rub that in. And my scalp. Just to give me a little bit of moisture. I like to wet it down. At the end, I had lock loops. So here's the lock loops. I ended up taking those out before I went out for my walk. So I just wanted to... Cause I didn't want to go out there looking like Pippi long stockings. They be like all over the place looking crazy. So I did take those out anyways. So let's go and see what is, what is given. And usually these, it lasts for like a, you know, a few days. Okay. So we got some crinkles. It ain't, it ain't crazy defined, but it's defined enough. And the thing about it is I only use water. Um, let me know below if anybody use anything else other than water, rose water, or maybe some people. Do anybody use um satin lotion? Like how you know you would get satin lotion put on your hair if you were doing the roller set to keep the rollers in um a whole lot longer. Um, do you, when you do your braid outs, do you use satin lotion or just plain water? Because that's all I use. I just, I just use plain water in mine. Um, and then I just go with what's there and, um, and when it goes out, it just, you know, when the crinkles kind of fall out or whatever, it just falls out. I just, I just take it from there. So that's pretty much how I'm doing but I hope everybody morning has gotten off to a good start and that everybody's doing well. You know, everybody's doing well, hopefully. Uh, I'm off again in a search for a J-O-B. I have an interview again today. So hopefully something comes through, um, you know, and hopefully it's just the right you know, the right situation, the right thing. I just kind of, um, kind of look at it as whatever is right for you will come through for you. So 
<laughs> That's the way I look at it. Uh, anyway, so yeah, so this is, yeah, this is good enough. This will probably last me about, I'll say a good two, two, three days, about two, three days. And then, um, I'll be uh, good to go. And I don't always do it because sometimes it doesn't uh, matter to me. Only if it's like if I'm kind of feeling like I just want to put a little bit of a style to it. I'll put the braid out and sometimes I'll just not even do the braid and just put the lock loops at the end and then just get a little bit of a curl there. Um, and then just wear it like that or just however just straight like however it's looking i'll get up spray it in the morning spray a little bit of water or something on it and then just um just roll you know roll with that um and if i want to put a little bit of color sometimes sometimes i might just add on my little handy dandy spray y'all know how i do it with that little temporary color spray and i'll do that but i haven't since i washed it i ended up washing my hair and um um, and I washed the color out because I think like last week or a couple of weeks ago, I had been using the color. And like I said, that temporary color, even though it's nice to have a little pop of color sometimes, you don't want to always put that in your hair because it still can be kind of drying. So like any type of thing you putting in, you know, whether it's them type of sprays and all that kind of stuff, you know, a lot of that stuff is all just chemicals anyway, so... You don't want to have that on your hair too often. You just don't want to do it. So, and um, that's no different. So, I definitely take a break with that sometimes too. So, yeah. So, it doesn't take long. See, guys, it doesn't take long. And um, so, this is the braid out. Hold on. Let me put a, ooh, I'm sweating. It's kind of hot. So this is how the braid out came out. Okay, guys. The front. Um, this side, I just moved around a little bit. That's how it's looking. And then I throw it to the back. I'm trying to see if I can get a view from the back. Yep. So, um... So there we go. Oh, hold on. Okay, hopefully. Anyways, that's what it's that's what is given, and that's what we going with today. So, anyways, I just wanted to come in real quick since I had done it. I know before I was saying I wanted to do a braid out. I just thought this was a good op opportunity to show what my braid outs be looking like. And it's funny too, like with with my hair and coloring because I wanted to do it, but naturally I do do natural hennas in my hair, like because I do have grays and stuff in the front of my hair. So I do the indigo uh, two step process. If anybody want to know how to uh, color their resistant grays um, in a natural way, you can go to Mahandi.com and then they have everything on there. Um, I've been using them for over about four or five years now and I love the results that I get. But um, it has actually naturally kind of you can see the difference because it's like it's darker here and then at the ends it's lighter so i kind of just use that as my little type of color thing because you can clearly see the difference if you come up on my hair especially outside you can clearly see and it's probably from the sun you know how like if you're out in the sun for a while it'll kind of like lighten up your locks and it actually has done that to my locks because if you you can even probably see it here in the uh, uh, bottom my locks are lighter brown and then these on the darker up top so yeah anyways with that said sharing is caring and teamwork makes the dream work so i'm out everybody have a great day peace